other keys are just a short distance away. As you practice, you will build speed, because you hardly have to move your fingers from one key to the next. You see, hunting and pecking at letters makes it harder to concentrate when you type. You also type slower and build the wrong muscle memory. The home row is awesome because it helps you know where to place your hands even without looking at the keyboard. Look, these are the F and J keys. Take both of your index fingers and feel for the bumps on these two keys. You can even do this without looking at the keyboard. Now curve your hands like bear paws and bring your fingers down on the next three keys on either side. When you do this, the letter G and H keys should be open without any fingers on them. Placing your fingers on the home row will help you learn to type faster and build the correct muscle memory. Now try doing it with your eyes closed. Anytime you find your fingers traveling around the keyboard while you type, remember to feel for those bumps on F and J and bring your fingers back to home sweet home.
thing go hand in hand? Most of us spend a few minutes to a few hours each day in front of the computer. Some of us, well, quite a bit more. In fact, the average American spends eight and a half hours in front of the computer every day. Because we spend so much time sitting behind a computer, we need to keep our posture in mind. Posture is the way we hold our body when performing an activity. While activities like running or swimming might be the first to come to mind, sitting is also an activity. Bad posture when sitting can be harmful. It leads to headaches, sore backs and muscles, and even pain after you stand up and leave your computer. And that's just after one day. If you keep the same bad posture for years, you can get seriously hurt and might even need surgery. Good posture, on the other hand, helps improve our concentration, letting us work longer and harder. It also prevents sore muscles, leading us to feel happier and healthier, both at and away from the computer. Now that we're all sitting, let's practice good posture together. Are you ready? Okay. Pretend you're at a fancy restaurant. Sit straight, don't slouch or slump. Look straight ahead. Make sure your eyes look directly into your monitor, the same way you would look at someone across the table from you. You don't want to have to point your head up or down. Adjust the height of your seat or your screen if you need to. If your feet don't reach the ground, make sure to use a footrest. Don't rest your forearms on the desk or armrests. Your wrists should hover just above the keyboard without touching it. Keep those elbows at right angles in the shape of an L. Now you're ready to work. These tips are good to keep in mind, whether you use a desktop, laptop, or even a tablet. Remember to check your posture every 15 minutes. If you notice you are slouching or slumping, take a moment to fix your posture. Your body will thank you. Taking a short break every hour also helps. In case you ever forget, try to remember this. Sit straight, be healthy.